I do really uh, appreciate the vibration that happens when you use near complements in the same composition. So I, I really like this yellow blue as opposed to the uh, sort of neutralized violet that's up in this corner. And I'm going to try to retain that relationship. The problem right now is the value of this shape, this shape, needs to be somewhat darker. So I'm going to go ahead and overspray with blue. The next darkest value thing is really quite light. I've linked a, a rather large shape together here. And what I've done is link the shadow from this petal and the inside of this petal and the inside of this petal to become one shape. And hopefully the viewer will read that as one shape. So let's go ahead and take that shape out. Go ahead and try to take this out. Kind of pushing down the edges of the frisket film that was adjacent to this large shape. I've revealed the next darkest value. In relationship to everything that's been done, they're really quite light in value. So I'm going to overspray those, a couple layers of yellow, a couple layers of red to, to make them orange. I, I may let the yellow be a little more dominant this time, both because I like the bounce between the yellow and the violet that's going on, also because yellow is just a naturally lighter hue than the red. That'll help get that lighter value. So let's go ahead and do that. Mm -hmm. 